What's going on everyone? We're at the Nashville airport, about to board my plane in about 30 minutes to head to Houston. So I've just been walking around, getting some footage of that, and you're about to see it right now. Uh, we've touched down in Houston and now we are at the Alpha Elite gym. And I'm with my new bros, David. Watt right here. What's up? Waiting on the rest of the guys to arrive and then we're gonna go work out, get some pictures with the Alpha Fit photography guy, and then head back to the hotel. Just ran up this massive track right here. Some of the guys are down there. The rest are up here. What's up, Corey? What's good? Got some more over there. We're just chilling up here at the top. This is the Alpha Lake Gym. And you. And we got a small football field over here. You just throw up your gang sign if you got one. <laughs> <laughs> About to head to the hotel. Uh, doing a last second little photo shoot outside and probably get about to eat. I'm officially at the room I'm staying in. Uh, my roommates aren't here right now, but shout out Watt and Sebastian and Jack. 
they're staying with me here. They're just somewhere else right now. I just got done getting ready. My face is hot because I'm, I'm like burning up. But anyways, yeah, we're at the hotel and here's what it looks like. And the beds are a little small for four people. So we may have some people sleeping in the floor or maybe even the bathtub. But our view is pretty sick. We have a pool right there. And you can't see it, but there's a hot tub about right there. And yeah, we have a good view of the city. It's sun setting right now. I think it's about 6.30, maybe 7 here. But yeah, it's been a very, very, very busy day. I've been going nonstop. I could barely even get on my phone just because of how much I was doing. I may have to split this vlog up into two parts. I haven't decided yet, but it may happen. So I just wanted to give a little update. I think me and some of the guys are actually about to go out right now, uh, just chill at a bar. Uh, probably won't drink, but just like chill there, have a, have a nice night out. And then we wake up at, or we wake up and have an alpha elite lift around 10 a.m. So that's going to be tomorrow morning, and we'll stay there most of the day and get some content and then have a guy's night out uh, tomorrow night. So that's what I'm up, up to right now. Uh, about to go out, and I will talk to you all tomorrow. Good morning everyone, um, it is 7.14, it's early, <laughs> I'm very tired, it's Saturday morning, we got a Alpha Elite lift, we're leaving here at the hotel at 9.30 and getting to Alpha Elite around 10 to have a full day of lifting, full day of getting shots, videos, all that good stuff, um, probably staying to about 1 and then we're getting some lifestyle streetwear top shots around this place. Sugarland. We're in Sugarland, Texas. And it is very cool here. The city of Sugarland right there. And then we have this whole area. This is our hotel where we're staying, the Marriott. Very nice hotel. And yeah. This is just where I've been since I've gotten to Houston. Uh, me and I don't know how many guys, but a lot of us guys are going to go eat breakfast 7.30, so in about 15 minutes. Get a little food in our stomach before we go lift. And that's just that's the plan so far. So just wanted to hop on here and tell you how my morning's about to go. And I will probably take a little vlog at the restaurant maybe or at the athlete gym so that'll be the next time you see me and I will talk to y'all then the amount of fat that I probably need that's what I'm saying I need like probably like 20 grams per person Not bad, right? <laughs> 
saying, Bab? It's just been a while since I've dropped some. I had the lemonade one. We're gonna work out in now. I was about to start my workout. I was about to warm up, and someone came in here that you, you know. We got Remington James in the house right there. I've followed this guy on YouTube for years, so being able to meet this guy, stay in his presence is great. I'm gonna go work out now. I pray that I used to. Finished a uh, workout at Alphalete, and now we are at the bodybuilder's um, favorite place to grub, <laughs> Chipotle. I am back at the hotel room. I've been back for a little bit. We've been very busy today. Uh, first we woke up, of course had breakfast. And then uh, we went to work out at Alpha Elite, got some pictures there, went to go eat, and then we got some lifestyle pictures in my brown jacket there on the bed. And I had some brown shoes on, but I got a little different outfit now because me and the guys are headed to go um, bowling at 7.30. So it's about 6.30 right now, I got another hour. But anyways, <laughs> Here's the fit, you know, just that casual all black look. <laughs> Can't go wrong with all black, but I got a little, little subtle flex down there with the shoes. A little casual. I'm gonna be taking them off anyways, but <laughs> yeah, this is just what I'm doing now. Just chilling in the room. Uh, I think some of the guys went to go eat, which I, I probably could have went with them, but. I'm not really too hungry right now, and I'm getting a little work done, so I'm catching up on some lectures, because, you know, <laughs> got to make college a priority too, but, yeah, today has been really fun, today's Saturday, it's the second day I've been here, it's been just crazy, I got to meet Remington James today, I got to meet uh, Justin Howes, uh, Justin J. Fit on Instagram, dude, he's one of my biggest inspirations, I just posted a picture with him, actually. And wow, just that was insane. Meeting Remington was insane too, but Justin was just like, he's like, he's probably number one for me. He's like my, my, my dude. He's like my favorite guy. And I also got to see um, Ryan Dingler again. He was back in the gym. He was there yesterday. But yeah, I, got, I snagged a few more pics with him. He's, he's really cool too. I'm glad I got to meet him. It is about sunset right now, maybe a little past. So I'm just, like I said, just chilling at the room. This is going to be an end to today's vlog. Because I could vlog the bowling, but I don't know. It would be kind of awkward. <laughs> but, yeah, this is going to be the end of this vlog. I haven't decided yet if I'm going to split them into two parts. But you'll see when they're uploaded. <laughs> but, yeah, I'm just chilling in the room, waiting to see what happens. And after bowling, I guess we're going to sleep and... Uh, tomorrow's the last day, Sunday. I'm leaving tomorrow around 5. But I'll probably vlog tomorrow too. Because I'm going to get one one last workout in at Alpha Elite. And I'm going to do legs. And yeah, we're going to have a good workout. Maybe one of the guys can uh, make a really good, a really, a really good, a really good recorded version of my workout. So I'm going to try and make that happen. But I will see y'all tomorrow morning, probably at Alphalete. Thanks for watching. If this is part 
two or one, I don't know yet, but <laughs> thanks for watching regardless. You'll see if this is the end or if it's another clip after this, but I'll talk to y'all later. How's it going everyone? It is day three in Houston and we are at the Alpha League gym. I'm just sitting here outside. We've got the football field next to me. Just chilling. I already had my pre-workout, just letting it kick in. Kind of taking some videos with this. And I'm about to hit a leg workout. May throw in a few uh, arms, maybe chest. Just, you know, get that last pump. Cause it's the last day, so why not? But yeah, I'm just here chilling until we go in there and work out. It's not too crowded today, it's Sunday. So I'm looking forward to hopping on a lot of equipment in there and hopefully someone can video me for a few sets. So, yeah, this is going to be the last day I'm in Houston. I'm going to vlog uh, this workout and yeah, I'll just let y'all know how it goes. So here we go. <laughs> I'm done with my leg workout. I'm just uh, finishing up with some shoulders and a little bit of arms because I'm gonna get some juicy picks. So we gotta get that pump going, but yeah, I've sweated through this whole entire shirt and probably some of my shorts too because it's hot in there and I was going hard. So yeah, ready to get the shirt off. It's like pretty much soaking, but I'm gonna hop back in there, grab some picks, probably end up uh, in the workout soon. And yeah, I'll get back to you. My flight leaves at five this evening, and I think that it's about 12, 12.30. I probably stay in like one. My mom's picking me up and we're headed out. So yeah, that's a, gonna be a wrap for Alpha Elite. I don't know if I'll video, video anymore here. This may be the last time I video at Alpha Elite, but I will talk to you all later. All right, I am officially back in Tennessee. And the thing is, I've actually been back in Tennessee for like, a week now I meant to take a video when I first got back um, from Alpha League a week ago and now it's Saturday a week later and I'm just now remembering I should have made this video but anyways I just wanted to kind of wrap up my trip kind of like talk for I don't know three or four minutes about my experience at Alpha League and in Houston in general so I'm doing that now a week later but anyways, last weekend, the Alpha Elite weekend, probably one of the best weekends, if not the best weekend of my life. Um, I don't know if y'all can tell by the vlogs, but I was just so happy to be there because I never thought I would be a part of something like that. And to be able to just have that firsthand experience, it, it just like meant, it just means a lot to me. And I liked, I liked to um, be able to meet everyone on the team in person. That was really cool. To meet some of my biggest fitness inspirations over the years, like Remington James, Justin Howes. Those, those two have been really big for me. Remington James kind of uh, showed me, like, I don't know, nutrition. Because I had a lot of questions when I was around 16 about how or what to get in the grocery store. And I remember just watching his grocery haul videos and like food prep and that helped me so much to dial in my nutrition better. And then when I met Justin, I've been following him for probably two years and he was a huge inspiration to me. Um, just, I, I can't even tell you how many workouts I followed that he posted. He would post uh, some of his workouts and I would do them. I would save them, I'd bookmark them on, bookmark them on Instagram and I would do him the next day. So he 
he showed me a lot of really good workouts just through Instagram. And to be able to meet him in person was really dope. Um, but yeah, the trip in general, it was amazing. 10 out of 10. I will never forget that trip. So many memories made. Um, I actually got like this shirt right here from my boy Christopher, my coach, the one that uh, actually reached out to me for this whole opportunity. Um, I can't thank him enough for all this. Just uh, if he wouldn't have reached out to me that day, I don't know what I'd be doing right now. I mean, I, pro I probably wouldn't be making this vlog. Actually, I know I wouldn't be making this vlog because I wouldn't have went to Houston uh, without him. So big shout out to Christopher Monosmith for this opportunity. Uh, and just so grateful for that. And shout out to Dan Lauskin. I may have butchered your last name just then, but I'm pretty sure that's how you pronounce it. Anyways, um, he is Alpha Fit Photography, and he was the cameraman for us uh, all weekend in the gym and out of the gym. And he did an absolutely amazing job. I've been able to look at some of the shots he has sent us because, like I said, it is a week later when I'm making this, but he I got back Sunday night of last weekend and he had the pictures ready for us to look at, all of us. Uh, he had them ready by Tuesday. And this man took over 6,000 pictures and drove 11 hours back to his place, to where he lives. <laughs> he, he like shocked me when he sent those out just Tuesday. Like, how do you do that? He's got a crazy work, eth work ethic, and I'm so excited to work with him in the future because he is a great photographer. So big shout out to Dan. Um, yeah, the whole, just, just to wrap up this vlog, um, just so grateful for all the experiences I've had this past weekend. And I can't wait to go back in June because we get to work out at the brand new Alpha Land that's going to be opening. I'm going to have I'm going to have a really good physique. I'm going to pull off a good physique. Physique. So when I do go back in June, then I'll be working out in the Alpha Lead gym, just like completely shredded. Going to get some really really cool footage, photos, and hopefully do well in the competition. I would really like to bring back at least a medal out of it. But even if I don't win, I. Oh, like even if I don't win, even if I don't place anything like that, just the feeling of hopping up on stage with this physique that I've been training for like six months solid is just going to be the most accomplishing feeling ever. And I'm so excited for that experience because I think it'll help me to help others going forward. And the reason I'm making these vlogs is for my own like personal tracking I want to remember this whole experience uh, of what I'm going through with summer shredding but I think it will also be a help to people going forward and doing this competition I think that this um, this certain competition needs more recognition going forward um, and these vlogs will be something helpful to look at because this is I mean I'm basically just going through it I'm just an I'm literally just a normal guy going through this competition phase and um, for future guys in like 2022 2023 and so on they can look at these from when I did it in 2021 and they'll know what to expect and just so you know I've only been doing this for two months and I've already gained so much experience and I've enjoyed every step of the way. Um, I can already tell my physique is starting to change. I'm starting to lean out a little bit more just because I've been very consistent with everything I've been doing and it's starting to show. So for like three or four months from now, I'm really, really, really excited to see what my physique will look like. But yeah, this is gonna bring an end to my uh, my Alpha Leap vlog that I've done this whole weekend. I think I am just going to make it into one big part. So you're welcome. You get all this footage in one video to look at. But yeah, I'm, it's it's getting late now. It's Saturday. It's late. I should have made this last week, but I, <laughs> I got busy. A lot of things on my mind, but I made it now.
and this video is going up tomorrow morning and you'll see this so thank you for watching if you did watch through this whole thing I really appreciate it I enjoyed making this I wanted to capture as much footage as I could while I was in Houston and Alphalete and I wanted to capture as much footage without being awkward I didn't want a video the whole time with all these guys that I was like just new to meeting but I, I videoed just like what I felt comfortable with but in, in June I plan on videoing a lot more so that one that one's gonna be really 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 good and hopefully my editing skills will just continue to get better and my vlogging skills will get better too but once again thank you for watching and I'll catch you in the next vlog